We are at the uh, front of Bear Canyon. It looks like a bus going on, a protest happening. No, I just want to be able to read the document that I'm being asked to sign. Reasonable. No, I will Before tell I you sign this, it. there's something on here that will not be on your citation. And that's going to be my observation. I mean, just as America, you got to read the fine print. Okay, we're now on uh, the open road. Chinese actually own it all. <laughs> yeah, it's uh, the Pineapple Glitch uh, on Ustream. You can get uh, kind of a stereo view here. Oh, wow, our viewers are jumping up really quick. There was a uh, Injustice protest alert. going on. Injustice alert! This HPD is, is creating an injustice! This is uh, primary election day in uh, Hawaii. The protest is here on the corner, right up the street from uh, Honolulu Hale. Yes. If they're going to screw us, we might as well be naked, and they are almost naked, but not quite. Apparently, uh, here's a sign that looks like it's a real political sign, a Hanabusa for Congress sign, but it says preoccupied. Hanabusa, let's talk about federal debt. The president refuses to sign. Oh, give each other high fives. Yeah, I know. That wasn't good right here. That's one of the ones we actually like. Yeah. A bunch of police here. Uh, they do their jobs so professionally. That was very professional. Thank you. So professional, gentlemen. They'd be making a cross before the damn timer starts. <laughs> hey, wait, wait, wait. wait. Please stop in the hey, Excuse me. Excuse me. Stop, sir. Excuse me. Stop. Excuse me. You need to come back here and get ran over. There are probably more police here than there are protesters. The protest is part of the political process, is kind of what I learned in school that was, that was a while ago. <laughs> hey man, that's the Pineapple Glitch on uh, stream. You can uh, tune in there and get like a stereo multi-viewpoint view, because I know you can like get both of us. <laughs> We're in the heart of that, so the state capitol building in the back, there's a... Uh, Replica of the Liberty Bell, and in front of the Liberty Bell is uh, is a tent. Both enduring symbols of uh, freedom. And that's Michael in the back. Hey, Michael. The guy in the Aloha shirt is a uh, policeman, what we call Aloha police. A lot of people with signs and demos today. I got one, uh, which is why I'm a little shaky. I have uh, my sign says uh, is directed toward uh, Mayor Carlisle, who is uh, struggling for uh, re-election as mayor. Mine says. Uh, Carlisle helps the homeless like Hitler helped the Jews. Okay, so that's fine. You didn't, you didn't want to advocate for it. You've seen that. You 
what he's trying to do there with others too. I bet you're looking at her top. But I didn't get the sign. Would you like to look at my my citation, sir? What? Why would okay. you get the sign? I am not. He was giving her an opportunity to sign it. I guess. I said I wanted to peruse the entire document. You know what's hilarious about this whole chain walking thing? Is this watch? I wanted to peruse the entire. Well, you were going to get it. Turn the lights on. I wanted to peruse the entire document before I signed it. Read before you sign. That's what our parents teach us. Read it before you sign it. Don't sign anything you don't agree with. Right. I am exactly. That's all right, guys. Come on. Let's get back to business. Screw this. All they're doing is bringing more attention to us. So. It's all right. Cool. Don't worry. Say what? Say what? Say what? Say what? Say what? Here in the corner of uh, Baritania and Punchbowl, down a couple blocks from the Occupy corner. I've got a sign and I've got a Ustream covering. Uh, Police came to try and break up a sign waving. A lot of sign waving going on because of the uh, I can't get actually close enough to get the uh, A lot of sign waving today because it's a primary election day here in uh, Hawaii. We're in the uh, heart of downtown. Right behind us is the state capitol building. Uh, right across the street, half a block down, the uh, residence of the governor. And down this street, which is Punchbowl, is Honolulu Hale, which is the uh, city hall. The, the protest, the signs waving attracted the attention of police because uh, it was very imaginative. <laughs> the main sign says, uh, if they're going to screw us, we might as well be naked. So there was kind of a naked theme, but as you can see, the uh, participants are no more naked than you'd see uh, at uh, the beach. And it's a way of uh, expressing uh, a real concern about the political system. Police came and wanted people to sign uh, citations. I can, I can, I can. What was the what was the deal? I want to I want to interview you when when I can, but I, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna turn around until you you deem it uh, doable. to to um, charge you with indecent exposure or like yeah. no, but, uh, my uh, duct tape was falling off and so well you could like see maybe part of like a nipple or something yeah like the areola it was like slowly coming undone and so I was just like well I have my shirt with me so I might as well just put it on and so the charge was for exposing too much skin? No, or? it wasn't. It was for pedestrian obedience to don't walk or upraise red palm. Oh, no. That is the official that charge. Is, that is the official charge. That is the official charge on this ticket here. The $130 charge, and they said that we were walking while the red hand was up, that we like entered the crosswalk while the wow, red hand was up. Wow, and they they gave you a hundred thirty dollar ticket. Thirty dollar ticket. Is that is that contestable? Yeah. Hell yeah. So there's this little section here. Yeah. Right. It says defendant refused to sign. Right. I did not refuse to sign, and right. I'm, I'm right. on I'm on record on. And you're on I videotape am, actually yeah. too. I'm on, I'm on videotape. 
asking to be able to read the, the entire Absolutely. document That's that right. I would be receiving before I signed. Right. Which I think is a reasonable request. That is reasonable. Because, I mean, I need to make sure that I understand all of the terms and conditions under which I am signing before that, I sign. That's what our parents tell us to do. Don't sign anything you don't understand. Exactly. Read the whole thing. And, you know, that you should be able to ask questions and that it's these people's jobs to help you answer those questions. Right. It's not because they have some other thing to do, which is what Officer Sweeney said. He told me that we were done after he gave me the document to peruse and he checked this. I Should never I refused to sign. Right, right. I we have that on video. To be able to read the entire document. That's interesting. Okay. So no, I, think that's, I think that's uh, falsifying uh, a police report. Information on a police report. That sounds like something sounds like, like that. Lying. It sounds like lying. Yeah. It's kind of like stealing, but like when the police do it, it's not stealing and lying. I guess when the police lie, it's called it's government operation or something. Yeah, like it's, 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 a, it's a bullshit ticket. This is where you need to remember to not lose this. This is, yeah, don't lose that. This is a, this is a great uh, protest, though. Definitely. This is really a great protest. The, you know, for a sign waving, there are a lot of sign wavers out today because it's primary election day. This is probably the best one. Probably. I'm super sad that, that my nipple tape is falling off. Yeah, it's a, you know, you, it's hard to get good nipple tape nowadays. I'm hoping, I'm hoping people can see that sign, but I'm going to read it anyway. It says, if they're, if they're going to screw us, we may as well be naked. <laughs> and uh, you know this is Hawaii and this is actually taking beach wear I guess on a little bit up the, the street actually the beach is just a few blocks down that way well, as mean, you can it is see essentially beach wear right like people wear less to beaches definitely and you can see uh, it attracted police immediately not not immediately. It actually yeah. took, it took a little bit longer than we were expecting. I was I was I was very uh, kind of insulted. I was manning the tent in front of the Liberty Bell with with my sign, and like police didn't care about that. I mean, what's the deal with that? I ha you know I had a tent no, in front tent. of the state capitol. You don't have tent. You don't have tent. You may have tent. I don't, don't have tent. <laughs> That's it. Tents are not. It's it's pretty powerful, but but um, I think it's true, and I don't like that. Thank you, I appreciate it. Huh? Oh, I think I don't know, but it was I think it was a group of. <laughs> yeah, I know you got to do it. When you can do it, you know, <laughs> support her on a motorized. Uh, I have a bunch of police. A bunch of police with like. Here's the sign I was holding. It says Carlisle. That's the current mayor. Carlisle helps the homeless like Hitler helped the Jews. And that's a little harsh, but it's true. You know, he he compared the homeless. He compared the homeless with rat infestation. He said it's worse than rat infestation. Well, because they're much, much bigger. Than they're, big, rats. they're like <laughs> big rats. And his his solution was to round them up and take their tents, actually, Both take all this the stuff that they need to live, and they can stay on the street, but their tents have to go wherever. They can't have any stuff, but I guess they can be there. We got a lot of people with stripes on their shoulders here. That's we probably got three like high-ranking dudes. We got people all kind of glittery stuff on their epaulets. Yeah, we're like this is like this is like that's like pretty cool. They can't. These guys can't figure out the movement. They're going. What? 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 What do we do? What would they, we gotta like do something? What's going on? What's going on? <laughs> I don't understand what's going on. <laughs> and, 
I often don't understand what's going on, but that has nothing to do with, with this. <laughs> it mostly has stuff to do with them. <laughs> So these are the, this is the corner, and that's the state capitol in the back, of course not in session, but an enduring sis, uh, symbol of the shopping mall of uh, legislative principle. <laughs> it's uh, very nice, has corridors, and really a really gorgeous place where you can buy and sell law, depending on who you are. And that's really what the Occupy movement is kind of like has a problem with the whole vending mall the law, I guess. Can you show me what democracy looks like? <laughs> hey, that's the pineapple where village at you are. Are. And I'm like, oh, he's right here. So like, you can, and you can watch both streams at the same yeah, time and like get... Uh, yeah, hey. Okay, I'm going to ditch the hat. I mean, I'm glad I had it. I know it makes me look like an auntie or something, but... <laughs> I'm gonna get a hipper, like ska boy kind of <laughs> head, you know. With like, it does keep the sun off. Yep. You should get Thank a you. trucker hat. I'm gonna get a, some kind of like. The trucker hat. <laughs> it'll breathe in the back, and it'll have a nice I got a lot of viewers here. Okay. We're at the world. This is Punchbowl, this street, and that goes down to Honolulu Holly, which is City Hall. Um, Interestingly, the mayor did not get the endorsement of the policemen's union. So, um, yeah, don't mind you filming and all yeah. that stuff. So when people are walking the sidewalk, you oh, just move on. Oh, sure, right sure, up. we'll do. You know, because we want to make sure that you know you guys are you know as far as you're allowed to do what you guys got to do. Great, great. You gotta, um, afford the sidewalk to those who are passing. No, what you're saying. I'll do that. I'll be careful. We'll be careful. Thank you. You know, a lot of these uh, officers know us, <laughs> and they're kind of, they assign uh, certain uh, police uh, to uh, the group, the Occupy. You know, I think, uh, whoops, we got, uh, we got, we got police over at the, is there police over there? I can't see that far. We might walk over to the, uh, I'm going to walk over to the other, other um, I'm going to leave that corner. We had another protest going uh, in front of the uh, Hawaii, that says Hawaii State Capitol, that's the building. We had another uh, protest going on there. The, the one with the semi-naked people actually uh, drew more attention uh, than this uh, tent in front of the replica Liberty Bell. Uh, I'm kind of insulted at that. I know I'm going to lose viewers too, but if you're watching the Pineapple Glitch, you can watch it uh, simultaneously, which is British for simultaneously, and actually get uh, a picture of... Uh, both uh, little pop-up um, protests. So this is the state capital, and we have we have a scantily clad protester here too. So you know you, you should stick around. And this is the protest number one or two or A or B or whatever. We pitched this tent in front of this replica. And here's the Abercrombie sign. Except it's been modified. It says, preoccupied, question mark. Abercrombie, that's the governor. Let's talk about houselessness. Absolutely. And the enduring symbol of uh, protest, the tent in front of a replica Liberty Bell, which is kind of tacky. It's very Hawaii style, you know, it's like, we'll get, we'll get like a replica of something and we'll just stick it in front of that. There also was here uh, before a uh, ki'i of Haloa that were built from stones. In fact, the, uh, the foundation is still here. And that was put up uh, during a rally uh, 
against the GMOs created uh, from stones by master uh, stone uh, makers, stone builders, and it was a tall structure that went into the air and on the top it had uh, a uh, sculpture of Haloa as a protest to the uh, GMOs, GMO industry here. You can get a look at the uh, tent. That's uh, Andy. You notice he has nipple tape on too, and yeah. it's what's fair for some and fair for. All right. Solidarity. Solidarity. That, okay. Uh, just doing a run to get some water. It's pretty hot over on. Boy, the I'm I'm kind of frying myself. <laughs> But you got that old man Asian hat on. You should be I right. got the old man Asian hat on. Like, thanks you for you mentioning. Old man Asian hat. And you know, I am an old Asian man, so like, <laughs> I should be able to wear the damn hat. <laughs> but like, but it's not. Racist. It's not at all. Well, it's not racist if I say it. You know, <laughs> I can. I can make old Asian guy jokes as an old Asian guy. Why can't I make old Asian guy jokes? Well, you. We'll, we'll let you make a couple. <laughs> <laughs> it, well, you know, there's no such thing. We learn. We. <laughs> yeah, I don't know why you have a Oh I'm yeah, there. we got to get your hat. I, I'm just. It's really a hot out here, guys. Yeah. Let's see. Anything you want to say? I. Well, we're. I got 14 viewers. Hi, 14 viewers. You should come down. It's it's hella hot out here. You should take a turn for us. But it'll get cooler later on. It is uh, almost one one p.m. here, ten yeah, to one so p.m. Yeah, so it'll get cooler at around like four thirty, maybe. Four thirty, and then it'll be neat. Um, so before then, we can get more shirtless people out. You should probably cover your nipples to stand in solidarity with uh, people. With what were you shooting? What were you using? I think blue painters tape. Duct that, tape. Du ooh, that's like. No, it'll it'll sweat right off. Well, sometimes it sweats off without. Yeah. Before the hurt. time. And like it doesn't even hurt to rip it off that much unless you have like a lot of nipple hair then it might be fun. Yeah. It's not you don't want to use that like on genitalia or anything or like that. Pasties. Yeah, I never where do you get pasties? I'm not, I'm not being paid by Susie's. <laughs> you can also make them at home DIY or die. But if you wanted to buy some like you could go to Yeah. <laughs> where's where's that? Pasties. I'm not even uh <laughs> Oh, okay. Yeah. It's like right across the street from the uh, Sears entrance to... Uh, oh, okay. And I can just yeah. walk in there and like yeah, order a couple of pasties. <laughs> you don't even have to order it. You, just you don't have to know your size or it's not like shoes. You should know how big your nipples are. <laughs> I never you know. measure them, you know? <laughs> you know. You don't have to measure them to be able to go like, okay, they're this big. Or they're this big, or they're this yeah, big. Yeah, you know, I'm not. I, uh. It says, uh, you are live on Occupy World News Now. Thank you. I want to have a moving pick. Moving. Thank you. Which is. Okay, it's, down to it says topless so protest. And this protester was topless for and people we, tuning in. We go, we just earlier. Really, you know. But the uh, nipple tape was coming off. And the cops uh, were getting worse. And the cops were getting worse, and they were <laughs> all over the place. I just didn't want to give them another fucking reason. <laughs> so she put a top on, but but it was good well, while it lasted. Another jaywalking ticket. <laughs> <laughs> a jaywalking ticket for having my nipples. Jaywalking show? ticket. Being naked and <laughs> jaywalking. Is that a special ticket? <laughs> and then got a jaywalking, $130 citation yeah, yeah. for being in the crosswalk with a red palm. It says... What, what's the actual... Pedestrian obedience to don't walk or upraised red palm. And it has red in, quote, in uh, parentheses here. It's a $130 ticket. And they... That kind of sounds like bullshit. Yeah, it is bullshit. <laughs> and they also mark me uh, re defending refuses to sign uh, after I told them oh, I just wanted to read the entire packet of information. And we have that, that on video that you actually wanted to read video. the entire document which has a lot of small print on it. Yeah, and it's nearly impossible, right, like when the officer is moving it up and down yeah. like this. Yeah. I have a learning disability, right? Like I actually have a legitimately documented difficult time decoding letters for reading. 
And so him moving this around and it being really fucking hot out, like, and I'm tired of balls. <laughs> it's been, it's really difficult to read this. You know, it's really small and moving. Yeah, like like we would have difficulty would be going like that. Yeah, so, so <laughs> let's, let's have Doug imitate the uh, yeah, jerkiness. Yeah, it'd be like this. Can you sign this? Well, I, you know, I can't really read it, and that's what it would look like. Yeah. Oh, I think we lost a couple of viewers just doing that. <laughs> Sorry, we didn't mean to make anyone ill. We should have put a warning. Uh, uh, Sam, you can explain this side. Uh, Abercrombie is the current governor. He's uh, not up for a record. And he's like, not up for, for re-election, so what is the deal with that sign? Well, first thing, it says preoccupied. Preoccupied. He does, he does not want to talk to occupied. So he's preoccupied with whatever he's doing. Uh, so we question, why are you preoccupied? The homeless issue is a very big issue in the world. Absolutely. It's a housing issue. It affects everyone. Um... We have a large military contingent of people coming to life that uh, was going to make the, the housing issue even more worse than it is right That's now. That's right. We need to talk about these issues before they happen. Not just let them happen and say, well, we'll take all the homeless off the street, steal all their stuff, dump it, and then throw them in, in uh, concentration camps and put them away somewhere. Nobody can see them, and then we'll be all happy because they will be there, and we'll feed them, and we'll just lock them up. That's right. That's why it says, uh, let's talk about houselessness, I guess. You know, they, he, he has the invitation. Uh, he comes out to the Hockey Boy encampment on Sunday, with a bomb, and talk to us. And there's a, there's a open uh, food not bombs every Sunday afternoon at uh, the encampment on Ward and Baratania. I, I'm, a, I'm a personal friend of Abercrombie. I was a presidential elector for a while, twice. Wow. And I, I've been a Democratic Party delegate to the National Convention. So, you know, Occupy has some very strong actors. Um, I, I myself am a federal employee. You know, uh, I, I'm really concerned with what's going on. Um, the, the House of issue is a very, very, very serious thing. Uh, I also represent Lady and the so, Abercrombie, you need to pay attention. Occupied people are not your standard run-of-the-mill activists. They're hardcore. <laughs> we want you to talk to us and talk issues. If you don't want to talk issues, then you're going to see theater. Now we're very, very good at theater. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks a lot. And that's for sure, definitely, right? And that's right here in front of the fake uh, Liberty Bell <laughs> in front of the some would call fake state of Hawaii state capital. This is the vast uh, uh, shopping mall of legislation where people will buy and sell legislation in, in the, Hawaii. One of the monoliths of the occupation. Uh, Not our occupation, <laughs> but the military occupation. The military occupation. <laughs> Hawaii. The military still controls... Uh, more than 20% of the land. 25% of the land, of the land uh, on Oahu. So. And uh, this is good because there are a lot of... Uh, I'm holding up my sign. This is at the actual symbol of Hawaii. What people uh, pay to see is the hula girls and buff dudes out in doing fire dances and all that kind of stuff and the reality of course is that more and more people are living uh, in tents. Um, the median single, the median price of a single family home on this island, the island of Oahu, is over $600,000 and in fact is reaching up to the price of Price peaks of 2006. Uh, 600, over 600 thousand dollars for a single-family home, a smallish one at that. Uh, a lot of homelessness. Of course, the wages are not commensurately high. In fact, they're very low. Here's Michael, he's one of our supporters. Ah, you got a pee? Yeah, we'll 
by the tree. <laughs> <laughs> no, this should be open in here, huh? Yeah, but it's no. downstairs and they, they lock the elevators. Oh. Yeah. It might be something. Well, there are advantages of being in the park. Yeah. <laughs> I might have to head out soon okay. to help Karen, who, who called while I was shooting. Thank you, Karen. You knocked us off. Okay. I'll go down. Should I, um, well, should I leave this? Should I leave that? I, I should, yeah. That's great. That's, that was the sign I was holding. Carlisle helps the homeless that give Hitler help the Jews. Okay, I'm going to sign off, guys. I'm going to save this so you can watch it later. Uh, I think the pineapple glitch is still broadcasting, so go to the...